What's up, YouTube? I'm back. Hey, so I put a video on yesterday about my laptop that wasn't coming on. So I, what I did was I opened it up. It's already taken apart, so I'm going to show you how to do this. Watch the other video I put on, and I'll give you a, it'll, you know where I was at as far as yesterday. So anyway, to take this thing off, it's an HP laptop. There's a screw here, 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 underneath these little feet. So you got to take the little feet back, peel them. There's screws underneath there. Pull those guys back. And what you do is, around the inside where it sits to this whole base piece here take a credit card or something you know something you don't need and just kind of pop it up and as you pop it it unlocks little tabs that are around the edges and when you get this baby up let me show you you pull this baby up your hard drive your your drive is gonna sit underneath this side so this is for the uh the cd-rom so this is everything in here so my battery goes up in here so my battery's good, I found out. So what I did was, if you look inside here, this is everything, so don't be scared. Um, so the battery connects right here. This is the whole tube here. So if you follow these two, these wires that go inside, let me show you here. You follow these wires that go, one goes in here to this board, and the other one goes into this board. So what I did was I just kind of pulled these back real gently, you can pry off on the corners right here, pop that out, and this thing will pop out. That's a little tiny, tiny ribbon cord. Same thing on this one. Um, peel this guy back and kind of this connector here. I pulled this guy out because this is where everything the battery the battery is powering to. So what I did was I just disconnected those guys for a second and put them back in. I let it hold off for a second. Um, let's put this guy out of here. Let me see. Now let me see if I can do this while I'm doing. So when I put the battery back in, um, let me show you. So there's little connect pins here for the battery terminal. So just line those up like that and they kind of go in like, like so, uh, hang on. There we go, see how it goes in and then boom, locked in. So now let me see if I can do this with two hands. Let's try this here. best idea but uh okay so i'm gonna open the baby up again make sure your battery's connected and i'm gonna hit the power now boom did you hear that and there it goes dude it powered up so i don't know if something died in there or what or bad connection but pretty much i just disconnected from where the power connects to everything and then plugged it back in. Now computers are notorious for that. So I guess I'll let it reload up and see what happens, but yeah, it's going now. Before I'd push power, nothing would happen. So bam, dude, that's it. So um, I'll put it back together now. So I'll wait for it to boot up. It looks like it's working, dude, sweet. I'm excited. So I'll power it back down, and then when you put it all back together, pretty much, you know, just put put it the same way you took it apart. So this is the cover. Uh, hang on a second here. A dangerous here. So yeah, well, to make it easier, I just pulled my hard drive out of this, and all it is is this little connector here. See, it just kind of hangs in that black thing there, right there. That's the connector for it. Um, yeah, so I'm working now. So pretty much follow those battery cables. So remember, this is your whole battery. Follow those ribbons. There's two there. There's a big one there, and then there's a smaller one. Disconnect those and let them sit out for a second, and then try to plug it in. If it keeps happening, there might be a problem with the computer. But yeah, but I'm, I'm up and going now, so sweet. Um, if this video helped you guys out, you know, I hope it did. So this is better than taking it down to the to Best Buy or Geek Squad, where those guys do, um, to help you out. But this did it myself. It took me about 10 minutes to get the cover off. Now I'll put it back in, put all the screws back in, snap the whole thing back together. Boom, fire up. So yeah. Um, if you guys like my video, um, don't forget to like and subscribe. And um, I'll put plenty more out, just like I always say. I'm just just starting to start out 
this whole thing and helping people out because I know how it is to look for videos that help you out. So, and this is a HP, um, just so you guys know, this model is my HP, um, let me see if I can zoom into it. Um, oh, over there, HP 15-BS11 3DX. Yep. So there we go. It's the touchscreen model. Again, it's only like a year and a half old, so it's working now. So I might put it back together and see what happens. Oh, you know what I also did? Forgot to tell you. I don't know what this battery. I'm, I think this battery might be for like the memory inside here. I pulled that guy out and put it back in. That's one thing too. I mean, maybe it had a hiccup in here. Who knows? Could have been. Could have been a lot of stuff, you know. But yeah, this is it. So all right, all right, guys. Thanks. Hey.